How's it? Any Cowboy Docs, Connect on December 31st. Happy New Year's Eve to you and Happy New Year. Hope you heard 2023 is wonderful. Uh, I am still in India. I will be back stateside in two days. So coming stateside, obviously when you travel from, from India back to the United States, you lose a day. And then when you, um, sorry, you gain a day. Uh, and then when you travel from, from the U.S. to India, you uh, you lose a day. But when you travel from India to the United States, you gain a day because India is uh, you know, obviously 10 plus hours ahead, um, uh, time-wise. So looking forward to come back stateside and I hope you guys are doing well. Have, uh, I think we missed our free play yesterday on the Portland Trailblazers. Let's try to get you a free play winner today. Uh, we are on a, uh, long-term run of, uh, about, you know, 185 and 151 on free plays. So hopefully we'll get you a nice free play winner today. A uh, nice YouTube premium winner yesterday as we gave you Miami in college basketball and they got it done. And, uh, Outside of that, hopefully we can post some uh, premium Doc Selections winners as well. But let's tell you what's up in our neck of the woods. Hello, I'm Indian Cowboy, and this is Doc Sports. Indian Cowboy has been around for 18 or 19 years now. And Doc Sports has been around for 53 years. I have a doctorate and a master's in biostatistics. That's how these algorithms work. <coughs> our best selections are over at DocSports.com under Arun Shiva, our Indian Cowboy. A lot of other great statisticians there, too. Our next best selections are our YouTube premium selections where I talk to you about an extra game every single day and give you two extra thoughts every single day. Uh, sometimes I'm going to try something different today and talk about one specific game and really kind of make it like an IC teaching channel, if you will. Uh, we kind of delve into depth in a game and how we analyze a game. It's it's an IC teaching channel. It's double the content, and we really go in depth so that we can try to kind of teach you and how we analyze games, how I analyze games, and that um, a lot of people enjoy it. And it's uh, you know you get 30 extra videos, and it's a lot of fun. So free $60 worth of uh, pr uh, premium selections on the link below uh, if you want to take advantage of the free uh, you know if you want to take advantage of extra selections uh, and that's free sixty dollars worth of it on the link below in the comment section uh, you can click on the YouTube premium uh, link as well in the comment section as well if you want to join that too if you want even more content hop onto our Twitter has our consensus reports our trends on late night ball games and our hot takes on sports all right your free play today is I like the under between Cal Poly and Hawaii today it's a late night ball game um, you know, the line opened up around 121 and a half. You can probably find it at 122 as the, as the day goes on. But I like the under 121 and a half. I know it's a super low total, but I still like the under 121 and a half. You have a 7 and 6 and a 10 and 3 team here. Hawaii, uh, heavy favorites here. Hawaii beat this team by 9 and 13 last year. Cal Poly just beat Cal State Northridge by 10, uh, who was a terrible team. Uh, and they lost to Washington by just 6 on the road. Uh, John Smith has a pretty veteran team. Hawaii beat Washington State at home, so they're actually a pretty decent team. They're actually a top 130 team. It's an extremely low total. I'm aware of that. Uh, the last three for Cal Poly, mind you, has gone under the posted total. Cal Poly is a terrible offensive team. I know the total is low, but I wouldn't be surprised to see this game even go lower. The under is 6-1 for Cal Poly after a straight-up win. And Hawaii traditionally does pretty well defensively against teams outside of the top 200. And I'll take the under 121 and a half with Cal Poly in Hawaii as your free play. Your extra lean here is I like the Knickerbockers and Rockets to go under the post of total. I saw a report that the consensus report that over 50% were backing the Rockets at home here, and I don't uh, I don't buy it. Uh, but, uh, you know, you have an 18-18 and 8 team here, 18-18 team here versus a 10-25 and 25 team here. Even though the Knicks have now lost several in a row, uh, New York won by 13 points early this year. I know the Rockets have a little bit of revenge coming in. Uh, and I know New York has, uh, you know, Phoenix on deck as well. Sorry, uh, New York has lost five in a row coming in. Lost to the Spurs in Dallas and Philly and Chicago and Toronto. But all are good teams. And obviously not having Brunson really affects this team. But this team just gave up 122 points to the Spurs. They've given 118 points the last four games. Houston has lost back-to-back -back games coming in. Lost by 15 to Dallas. Lost by 24 to Houston to Boston. Uh, honestly, right now, either team really can't be trusted. But Houston plays a lot better defense at home if you've been tracking them. They are 4-1 and one to the under at home uh, on defense. On the road, games go over for Houston. But at home, games have been going under for Houston. So I lean on the under between the Knicks and the Rockets. That's what we have for YouTube Premium. I'll see you in five minutes as we're on a 4-1 and one 10 and 3 and 36 and 14 runs. So we out of the last 50 plays for YouTube Premium, we've hit 72%, which is exceptional. So hope you guys do well, and I'll see you back here tomorrow. Indian Cowboy working hard for you every single day.